Moving on, Italian Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte has lashed out at suppliers of COVID-19 vaccine over delay deliveries. Rome has even threatened to sue Pfizer. Conte has said that the delays in deliveries amount to serious breach of contractual obligations. Rome was forced to cut its daily COVID-19 vaccine rollout by more than two-thirds. A senior health official has now warned that Italy will have to rethink its whole vaccination program if supply problems persist. One of the leading COVID-19 vaccine producers, Pfizer, announced last week that it was temporarily slowing supplies to Europe in order to make manufacturing changes that would boost output. AstraZeneca has also informed the European Union that it would cut deliveries of COVID-19 vaccine by 60% due to production problems. Conte said, and I'm quoting here, this is unacceptable. Our vaccination plan has been drawn up on the basis of the contractual pledges freely undertaken by the pharmaceutical companies with the European Commission. And deliveries present, represent serious contractual violations with enormous damage to Italy and other countries. We will use all available legal tools as we are already doing with Pfizer, BioNTech. According to the Italian government, Pfizer deliveries were 29% lower than planned this week. It is expected to be reduced by another 20% in the coming week. And Italy's higher health council has said that supply is expected to return to agreed levels by 1st of February. Now, according to the Italian government, the country was administering 90,000 jabs a day around two weeks ago. And at this point, inoculations have reduced to 20 to 25,000 per day. Remember, at least currently using COVID-19 vaccines pr produced by Pfizer and Moderna, the vaccine produced by AstraZeneca and Oxford University still awaits clearance across to Europe and Italy is now expected to receive 3.4 million doses of AstraZeneca vaccine as opposed to the 8 million that was initially promised. Italy is the second European country after Germany which has administered highest number of jabs that is 1.31 million. Now on Saturday alone Italy reported more than 13,000 cases of COVID-19 and 488 deaths. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.